the Conqueror of Copper Bell returns. Thanks to you, our mining operations can resume, and Old Dog will have the materials she needs to rebuild. The entire nation's in your debt, friends. I'll share the good titans with Papa Sean the next time I see him. As for you, you'll want to report to Mamodi. It'll do the woman well to see you live and in One Piece. Nod. A one Piece is real. Ba -ba -bow, ba -ba -bow, ba -ba no. <laughs> the swiftness that we responded with. Shut your mouth, you thieving little swine you stole from me. Don't even think to deny it. Okay. P please, sir, I didn't steal nothing. I, I bought this. Paid for it with me own coin. Why does everybody sound like a pirate? What rot? You refu er, you refugees are all the same. Couldn't afford maggoty mole meat, much less a choice cut of dodo. <laughs> I'm gonna say it one more time. Give me back what you stole or I'll make you wish you'd never set foot in this town. By the rights, I should turn you over to the bar brass blades. You know, help keep the streets safe for law-abiding citizens. But I'm a reasonable man. If you agree to serve me in whatever capacity I require, the authorities needn't hear your crime. What? He's... Ha, 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 ha. I don't like this. Ha ha. It's funny. No. Get it? No. But, but I ain't done nothing wrong. Twelve as me witness. And Wyvern. And Meteor, sorry. P please, adventurer, help me, I beg of ya! I swear on me mother's grave, I didn't steal nothing. I bought this with the coin I'd saved. <laughs> I only wanted to treat the children to a decent meal. Hmm, what's gonna happen? Pop -pop. Yo! And who the hells are you when you're at- uh, wait. Who oh. the hell's- wait, and who the hell's are you when you're at home? The dog- oh, this dog's master- Oh, no, I guess I- it, actually. Yeah. I- okay. I had enough of your- this mummer's farce. You lot teach them a lesson. I have to relearn how to play this game. <laughs> Says you're good yawning in the first oh five minutes. Oh my god, it's cause my room is cold. Yo! Wait, what? The music! Uh-huh. Uh, uh, yeah, music. I have no, I have no idea what's happening. I believe this is FF2, but is this a yeah. one battle theme? Or FF2? I know we just played hours and hours of this, so you think I'd know. You know, other fun fact about Shiloh, he's who got me into this game. Um, I need some help. Like, I'm not having problems beating it, but like, my Aeolian Edge is not working. My 3 ability. I don't know what I'm doing wrong. I have no idea. Yeah, I know. Shiloh, what's he doing wrong? Please, if you're still here. It's supposed to combo off of Gust Slash, but it's not. Oh, wait, it says action not yet learned. What? I... Oh, because yeah, it's duty was synced. Oh, duh. Oh my god. You're synced down. I forgot. I forgot. To eye level. I beat it. Are you done? Oh, yes. Right. You're waiting on me? Yeah. Okay. I ain't getting paid enough for this. Hey, where the hell do you think you're going? His haircut's really ugly. Yeah. Thank you, kind adventurer. Thank you thrice over. Oh no. She's the Mother Crystal's son, daughter. I meant, I'm gonna, okay. I'd swear, there were more refugees when I last looked. And you wouldn't be mistaken. But it's been five years since the Calamity. Why are they only coming here now? It's simple, really. 
While a number of hamlets survived the immediate aftermath of the calamity, many were no longer able to support their communities. The residents found their lands had either been rendered barren or cut off from trade routes, and problems like those aren't easily solved. Though they tried to make the best of it, it was only a matter of time before they were forced to abandon their homes and seek a new life in the city. I see. But the calamity affected the whole realm, didn't it? It's the same thing happening in the other cities? If the talk is true, yes. Though perhaps our situation is more pronounced. Uldal has a reputation for being prosperous, so it's natural that the refugees would try their luck here first. My heart goes out to them, it truly does. But I would be lying if I said that I wasn't apprehensive. I hope the presence doesn't, uh, f f f foment? Yeah, foment lawlessness in the city. I hope that these refugees don't solve, do crimes. We'll find out. Well, if things do take a turn for the worse, we always have the immortal flames. I dare say the brass blades would welcome their help. The heroes who fought to the Garlean Empire were chilling the streets for riffraff. It may well come to that. Yeah. Impoverished and desperate as they are, you may be sure that some of the refugees will turn to crime. You know what this place is like. If you've no coin, you've no hope. Huh. <sighs> what will become of our city? Not all refugees are bad, mind you. Some are able to find employment and lead honest lives. Ding dang refugees. Darn tootin' Shiloh. Oh, dodo tenderloins. Get your dodo tenderloins here. Granted here, granted, uh, guaranteed the cheapest in no Thailand. Yeah, the stream titles I can't read. I think it's you. Thank you for the curse, my madam. Please come again. Looking around, do you think Uda uh, that uh, you think that Uda was well on its way to recovery? I read a whole visual novel today, Aspi. Next stream uh, title is Iron Echo. Can't read through the veil of prosperity, and you'll see no end to the misery of suffer and suffering. Next stream title is Iron Echo. Can't read. We can't read. Yeah, for real, Shiloh. It's the two of us. Oh, Shiloh. Hey, thank you for following. Appreciate that. Um, oh. madam. Are you all right? Nod. What? What now? You mean to threaten a defenseless citizen? What? Saw her busy that meat. Uh, buy that meat. You say that? That's absurd. Uh. Ah uh, yes, I. Oh. As did I. Leave the poor woman alone, you damnable vulture. Who is... Oh, I see her. Oh, wow. There she is. In the back. Who said that? I didn't know Edith was in this scene. No, did I? Grr, I will overlook this, but just this once. Gods bless the adventurer. If you hadn't come along when you did, who knows what that monster might have done. It don't bear thinking about. Yo. We did it. Please be voice oh. acting. No, there's no voice acting. Case closed! Case closed. Oh, you can do it. Hello again. We have been keeping a close eye on you ever since you left Gridania. You, your discharge, your duty is envoy impeccably. Never once faltered in the face of myriad dangers. But more importantly, you were always ready to help those in need, even if you didn't stand to earn guilt by doing so. You are possessed of all the qualities we seek in an adventurer. Of this, we are convinced. Sorry, I was trying to find a way to change the stream title, and I can't do that. Of mine? Yes. Why would you be able to? Well, I'm a mod. Even if you were dragged into the business with the dodo meat. Just know SP can't read for reals. Uh, yeah. Oh, that's you. Yes, thank you, Ida. Um, and then <laughs> there is the matter of your gift. I dare say you are curious as to the nature of the vision you bore witness to moments ago. Well, we can help you understand it. You're not the only one with that power, you know. We have a friend who has it too, and we'd love for you to meet her. Yo. 
And meeting her- Wait. Oh, that's you. Oh, yeah. And meeting her is only the beginning. For we would also have you lend your strength for our cause. In return, we should be glad to assist you, your adventuring endeavors in whatever way we are able. Should you decide to take us up on the offer, and I sincerely hope you will, pray speak with Mamodi. The proprietress of the quicksand is a good friend of ours. She will tell you where to find us. Um, I know things will be explained yet. Ishtola feels like she's the main of the scholars. She's not a scholar. Yo, they said the Final Fantasy XIV thing! Sorry, go ahead. What? Go ahead. Wait, wait a minute. We haven't even told you the name of our order. We're the Scions of the Yo! Seventh Dawn. <laughs> Defenders of Justice. Oh, but don't tell anyone except Modi. She knows already. Scions of the Seventh Dawn, that's on the t-shirt! It is on the t-shirt you have. I do not have that the That is 14. true. You know, you've seen all the people on the t-shirt, huh? I do not have the FF14 shirt from Unique Low. Oh, good. Okay, don't look at it ever again. I want it. You can look at it after uh, patch 5. Nope, patch 5.5. I'm being held so hostage. Right, right, right before we go into Endwalker, you can... Hey, it's Easter, Espy! What is... Is there an event? There is! Uh, can this be an event stream? Let's turn Let's turn in our quest first. I have to get everything. And then we'll do Easter. Yes! Mamodi! She's a widow. She's with a baby by her... I believe you were Mamodi, yes? Mm, okay. Hm. Seems like that are becoming even more common, I'm afraid. Don't worry, though. If you work hard, you'll probably be alright. Wait. Look at my stream. Uh huh. What about. You yeah, know, she's not talking to us. That's oh. some random guy. I thought it was a. Uh... <laughs> okay. <clears throat> Saying that, if you ever find yourself in a spot of bother, come and see me. Just don't go pester me every time you graze your knee, eh? Of course, I do enjoy hearing tell of a gentleman's woes with the women folk from time to time. Yeah, for a second I thought it was like a Please glitch. Please, without saying anything. Ah, why even meteor? Sorry to keep you waiting. I was just providing guidance to a fresh shop the carriage adventurer. But God, it's good to see you safe and well. To look at you, no one would ever guess you'd been hard at it with the giants in the dark. You're every only adventurer me own said you'd be live and meteor. <laughs> the station master will be overjoyed when he hears the news. Oh, before I forget, there's the last here who wants a word with you. Didn't actually know your name, but here in her description, I knew who she meant right away. Yo, it's her. It's Edda. Remember, she's the one that um, yes, was at in front of she Satoshi. She killed her friend. Her well, she didn't do that. She accidentally let him die because she didn't have healing. Because so they were being she... bullied. But also, she has her boyfriend's head. Oh, that's her boyfriend? I must have missed that. Oh, um, no, wait. No, were they not dating? I don't no, know. Maybe, whatever. Party member. She has her party member's head ba, ba, on her. Ba, 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 ba. Um, th thank you for sparing the time. I realize I don't know, you don't know me, but I've been lo longing to speak with you for a while now. The head salt. My name is Edda. I'm an adventurer like you, though I'm not very good at what being one, if truth be told. Anyway, I was adventuring with my friends in Gridania when... When? I, I, I'm sorry. We, we were in Gridania and when the leader of our party was killed. His name was Aver, and he and I were to be wed in the spring. Oh! Oh, fiancé. Fiancé? Yeah. Uh, you may not remember him, but to say that he remembered you would be an understatement. He would sing your praises from dawn to dusk. Uh, he saw you for what you are, you see, an adventurer's adventurer, and swore that he would like to uh, be like you one day. I believe that he would uh, have succeeded had a fiend not robbed him of the chance. Since that day, I have thought long and hard about giving up adventuring. But when I think of the man you are, or woman you are, uh, okay. man and woman you are, people you are, <laughs> uh, human beings you are, and uh, human and uh, dragon person you are, of all that you've achieved, I find that I'm inspired, just as Aver once was. I'm going to give you and a so lesson. so I've decided to start again as an adventurer. I'll go back to the village of my birth and begin a training anew. But I wanted to meet you first, to ask you for your name. Z Uh, Meteor and wife, I shan't forget. Thank you, Meteor. Only you, though. I oh. pray we will meet again. Farewell. Ow! Fare you well. <laughs> Adventuring can be a cruel, bleeding business. Time was, I didn't know why anyone would bother. When they first asked me to take charge of the guild here, I didn't want aught to do with you lot. 
thought I'd be right pain in the arse looking after you all. But against my better judgment, I decided to accept the post. And I'm full glad I did. I feel privileged to be a part of your lives. And that goes double for yours, only wife. <laughs> Us girls gotta stick together. Uh, what'd you say? You wanna know about the Scions of the Seventh Dawn? I, I rolled away. They're beginning to move in earnest then. Listen, wife, only wife. The Scions ain't no ordinary folk, and the work they do ain't no ordinary work. I know full well how capable you are, but even you would think twice about attempting some of the stuff they do. Knowing that, if you're still certain you want to get involved, I'll tell you what I can. We'll also accept the quest and just not go, just so yeah, yeah. that we can. Yeah. You found your way to Quicksand, Wive. As you can see, we catered to a clientele with an adventurous streak. With the chaos left in the calamity, uh, with the chaos left in the wake of the calamity, the townsfolk will be needing the help of patrons more than ever, especially come adventurers like yourself. Why didn't she give me the quest? Oh, there we go. So, you want to know more then, do you? Well, ain't that a surprise. I swear, if I painted certain death on one door and limitless wealth on another, 9 out of 10 adventurers would go through the first, and the other bloke wouldn't be able to choose on account of being well done. Anyway, don't say I didn't warn you. First of all, if you're wondering whether you can trust these scions of the seventh dawn, you can. They're good people who've made it their mission to solve, to solve some of Eorzea's most present problems. Of course, that ain't no small task, and so they're always looking for dependable individuals to join them. Individuals like you, Meteor. Now, I've been given leave to tell you where to find the Scions, but you must promise to keep this information to yourself. As you can probably imagine, it's something Eorzea's enemies would very much like to know. Scions are headquartered in Vesper Bay, out in western Thanalan. The place you're looking for is called the Waken Sands. Give your name to whoever's at the entrance, and you'll be let in. You're a group in demand, and the days ahead promise to be busy, but I hope you won't forget about them as you helped make you into the adventurers you are. Drop in and tell them how you're faring from time to time, you hear? Right, well, I've said my piece. Off you go. Yay, I'm gonna let you know now. We're gonna be going to the Waken Sands a lot. Alright, fuck the Waken Sands. It's Easter time, bitch. Oh yeah, we are. Easter time, let's go. Wait. I like it. Okay, where's the event? I don't know what um, I'm looking. What am I looking for in the map? I'm. I don't know. Let me talk to this guy. See if this is him. It's not. Um. Oh look, these little no. thingies are e Easter eggs. I know the Easter event is here. But I don't know where. I uh, think it's here. I could become a pugilist. Yep, that's a monk. Oh. They're pretty cool. Um. This courteous what? collector, is it him? Uh, maybe. No, that's. There's a, should be a the the quest right back here. Maybe that's them. That's what I'm saying. Is it him? Yeah, it's him. Um, Touch him. Yeah, no, it's not him. He's he's literally telling me about the event. Oh, he just okay, telling me about. Okay, this is not the event. Well, he said the Hatching Tide Festival. I... Yeah, I don't know where it is. Hello, Egg. Egbert. What up? Okay, I guess I'll look it up. I'm gonna listen to the music. I know I'm not wanting to You know Sovikin? Sovikin. <laughs> oh, it's Kenny. <laughs> it's, it's, Hello. It's a real Thank life you for friend. subscribing to the YouTube. Thank you, Kenny. You are welcome here. He, Don't he believe Espy's lies. He dropped a- Kenny, you're- you're- you can be here. You can be here. We're gonna also, do, we're gonna egg, do the, I'm very sorry you were sick. We're gonna do the Easter event. I want to figure out where it is. Hatching Tide is... Gradania. Where? 
New Gridania. I'm teleporting there now. You can come. Don't know. Stop. There you go. Papaya. Also, I can't believe I've never seen anyone make the joke Hilo to, to Shiloh. Oh! Oh? That's loud. Okay, we're going to the amphitheater. Uh -huh. SP Cat. I'm sorry. Oh my god, it's so loud. Uh, amphitheater is going to be... Don't tell me. I can read. This is a different stream. Uh-huh. Iron Agar, I can't read. The tele- the- the teleport. The return. No, nope. no, 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 Oh, right, yes, yes, yes. We're learning. Nope. We're learning. Nope, nope. You just thought to teleport! Uh, the eighth right! Yeah, you're gonna... No? We're in a city. Remember? You remember what to do when we're in a city and you need to teleport somewhere within the city? Can I not teleport from the actual eighth <laughs> crystal? Click on it, that crystal in the middle. That's what that's what I was saying. That's exactly what you I was saying. Up your teleport. And right. then I closed it and I said, "No, I need to go to the big thing." Where am I going? Shut up. <clears throat> Where am I going? The amphitheater. I don't have that. Yes, you do. Oh, nah. You said you said it's me, Keto's amphitheater. It's different. Ah, uh, I see. I can't. I can't. I can only read what's told to me. Wait, do I get the, the Tom Berry outfit? Oh, yeah, you do. Oh, this is fucking sick. Alright, let's go. So, we talk to... Get along and play knife. Jili... Jili Aliapo? Mm -hmm. Greeting! Oh, wait, you're not in the cutscene. There we go, there we go, we're good. Sorry. Okay. That's fine. Oh my god, this is so cool! Greetings, friend, and happy happy hatching tide to you. Allow me to introduce myself. My name is G uh, Jilly, Jilly Alfio. Oh, Alfio. And I facilitate the annual hatching tide festivities. You're an adventurer, are you not? Might I ask you for, for your name? So you know if you've... The holiday events will usually repeat the characters that are in them most oh, of the so time. Oh, so now next time... And, oh, Wive, good to see you. Er, yes. Mm -hmm. Okay. Wive, tis a meet here and wife. Tis a pleasure to meet your acquaintance. Yeah. Uh, in case you're unaware, hatching tide festivities were considered a number of years ago. Um, after I was first visited by the twelve archons in a stirring and prophetic, prophetic dream, and I confess I've been dreaming ever since. Oh, I am e most eager to share my latest dream with you. It was highly peculiar to say the least. You see, I beheld visions of that chilling creature of legend, the Toneberry. You. S I'm sorry. Hold on. No. 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 The what? The tone bear. Ton. 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 Oh. Ton. Every. If past experience has taught me anything, it is that painstakingly recreating my dreams is sure to bring about good fortune. Toneberry. Tone berries are not no! figments of fa old fables. I begin to doubt whether I could ju do justice to their ghastly appearance. I... But that all changed when this gentleman great generously offered his assistance. <sighs> Greetings, my lady. My name is Hamlin, and I am what you might call a supreme connoisseur and passionate aficionado of all things Tonberry. As you may or may not be aware, Tonberries have heads as round and adorable as any egg, which is why I believe they are the perfect addition to the Hatching Tide festivities. So I donned the superior mantle of Tomberry and presented myself to Miss Geely here. <laughs> what luck, wouldn't you agree? Hamlin was uh, kind, in, uh, yeah, kind enough to furnish our other volunteers with Tomberry guises, and we're all hard at work preparing for the upcoming fun. Ooh. Ooh, what do we say? It's like a choose-your-own-adventure book. Mm -hmm. I'm thinking, and a lot of eggy, stabby fun it shall be. I like that one. Exactly. That's the spirit of Hatching Tide. Perhaps without the stabby part. Considering my dream, I think these festivities present a unique opportunity to share the Toneberry's charm with the world. But there is but one problem. Our group of uh, sylphs have been making mischief throughout town. Uh, playing pranks, sabotaging the decorations. Uh, 
Luckily, it seems a mere glance of the Tomberry form is enough to send those leafy brigands fleeing in terror. Is it not remarkable how such an adorable visage can strike such fear into the hearts of some? Does not the contradiction of the Tomberry's nature invigorate your very soul? <sighs> That's probably not what they meant by heavy breathing, but... <laughs> Our other volunteers are using the Tomberry's disguises to shoo away the sylphs the best they can, but still find ourselves short-handed. Would you be willing to assist us, Meteor and Wife, just until the mischief is mitigated? Nod. My sincerest thanks. Hamlin has prepared a plethora of guises for us, so I'm sure he will have one that fits you. Nice. Also, Egg, have you gotten to throw a flashbang at the Plaga after they have popped out, as I have suggested? In the Discord. Now then, let us commence with his most sacred of ceremonies. Come closer. You must continue wearing the Tomberry guys in order to progress. Speak with Hamley to restore. Oh. Okay. Now, uh, oh, do I need to? We are oh. Tomberries. I know. I know. Wait, I can do this. Stay still. Oh. Um. I'm just getting out of the way. I'm doing my m money, money evo. Alright, so the first one's okay, gonna be over here. Okay, let's go over here. Uh, there it is. The Wily Willy Winer. Winer. Well, if it, uh, these ones can't have fun with the tusk ones, the walking ones won't have any fun either. This one will make sure of it. But how about some eggy, eggy, stabby fun? Ha! A monstrous one! This is why these ones need tusk ones. Man, this is kind of weird when you have absolutely no context of what a sylph is. Excited amphibian lover. Hide well, warty one! Then spring out and make the walking one screech and jump! Hee <laughs> This one can't wait! Let's have some eggy, eggy, stabby fun. Hey! That's you. Nope. You're the interloper. No, I'm the... Nope. I'm the... Nope. The amphibian one is first. Yeah! And I just said, I -E, and now the interloper... You did not say, oh, I-E did not come through for me. Okay. That's, I was confused. I did not hear say anything. Uh, scary one, scary one is here. Flee, flee. It may not have come through. That's why I'm like, um, nope, that's... No, I was waiting for you to make noises, and there were no noises. I was confused. Oh! But, but, but if these ones are naughty, elder one will become scolding one. No one will know it was these ones. Besides, it isn't that naughty. <laughs> Don't be naughty. Have eggy, eggy, stabby fun. Yeah, please. This one didn't mean any harm. Eee, sticky one, get out of the way. We need to go back to him. We did it. Wait, that's not the whole event. That is uh, not the Probably whole. not. It might be. If probably that is though. if that is the event, that's embarrassingly short. Easter's, uh, they don't usually put much into it, to be honest. Might be a second quest, though. I'm just waiting for you to come, so I'll start talking. All right. Okay. I trust you returned from a job well done. I am sure Miss Jilly would like to hear the particulars. You may, you, you may relay your report after I... Relieve you of that outfit. Oh, I wanted to keep it. Tell, 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 tell. I'm glad to hear those silks fluttered back home. Thank you for all of your help, Meteor and Wife. Yes, you performed most admirably. Not only in deed, but in dress. Upon beholding a Tom Barry performing such selfless acts of valor. The citizens of Gridania are sure to have warmed to our adorable paragons of pointy justice. 
all according to plan. Our other volunteers are currently making the rounds and checking the rest of the decorations for any res uh, residual, residual surprises. But I dare say we'd be able to officially begin the celebration soon. All that's left is to wait for our Archon Ace to arrive from Ulda. I hope you enjoyed the festivities. Something tells me this shall be a hatching tide to remember. Oh, they're probably doing like different parts. Oh, never mind. We have a problem. I have to do Panic Voice. This is going to be Disney Channel. No, no, Tuh. Whatever is the matter? It's the eggs, Jilly. The Archon eggs. Sylph swarmed the shipment as it entered the central shroud and zapped the delivery man into a frenzy. The caravan has been brought to a complete standstill. I'm trying to go for Major Gulp. He's right behind me, isn't he? If only you'd seen it. The chaos. The carnage. The eggs. Our beautiful Archon eggs scattered across the ground. Sylph's pilfering them like spriggans and that smoking mammoth rampaging like an old goat possessed. Twas sheer mayhem, Jilly. The Sylphs presented no demands, offered no reason behind their rampant pillaging, but they did keep squeaking about tusked ones and no fair and why should walking ones have all the fun? What do you suppose they meant? Ah, uh, I heard the Sylphs once held an annual spring festival, but there is an uh, incident involving one of the fighting boar or their fighting boars. I believe that was the end of such festivities. I understand how it must be pain for them. Uh, yeah, it must pain them to see us cheerfully preparing for hatching tide. But those ill-gotten eggs won't ease their suffering. We must find a way to recover them. <laughs> if I may be so bold, I believe I have the perfect solution to your conundrum. Their assistance will be crucial, however. <sighs> You will lend us your aid, yes? Nods. Oh, the name of the quest was Get Along and Play Knife. That's funny. Mm -hmm. Is there... Is there... Yes. yes. Okay. Oh, we get Ballroom Etiquette, Unnerving Undulations. Oh, we, get, we have a new emote. Frighten. Sorry. You wish to lend your strength to my brilliant plan, do you? Very well. Our divine mission is as follows. We must adorn ourselves in the guise of the Tomberry and scare the Sylphs away from the fallen eggs. <clears throat> it may seem like a rather familiar tactic, but terror cuts as sharply as a knife in the right hands, as does the power of the Tomberry. We shall remind those Sylphs of what adorable horror, horror lurks in the shadow. Mm. It is time to take the Tomberry's natural winsome and captivating massage and transform it into a mask of pure evil. Observe! I suppose that makes sense. But what of the delivery mammoth? In its panic state, it may easily mistake us for not but common egg thieves. Uh, perhaps not so common considering the guises? That's where wise participation is crucial. Even an overexcited automaton, shout out near, is no match for an adventurer versed in the arts of warfare. Of course, I shan't be so cruel as to send you into battle as defenseless as a swaddled ton, babe. You may rely upon me to perform the necessary... What the fuck is a schlorp? <laughs> Enhancements upon your guys. That shall grant <laughs> any stabby sweetheart the ability to withstand even the harshest of electrified zaps. In theory, anyway. In the midst of adversity lies opportunity, as they say. Or rather, in the midst of scattered archon eggs stands the noble Tomberry. That all might witness its triumphant glory. Very well. Let us proceed with Ham's plan and see that our eggs are recovered safely. Ha! Excellent! I excellent! Alright, guys, thank you so much for coming out. <laughs> excellent! I shall commence the enhancement of this guise at once. And have it ready for deployment in two flicks of a Tomberry's blade. Friends, let us meet where the bells of destiny toll. To arms! That is a very Kingdom Hearts line. Yep. Yo, Kingdom Hearts collab? Uh, no. 
Yoshi P has said he doesn't ever want to have to do that. Why? Because he doesn't want to have to work with Square on this game, or with Disney on this game. Yeah, it's too difficult. he would have to do that, wouldn't he? Yeah. Where are we going? Like, the process is too long. It cannot fit into the development cycle. Uh, we are going... Let me check my journal. To the central schedule shroud. Bent yep. Branch Meadows, which is outside. Yep. Well, we can still teleport to Blue Badger Gate, right? Yep. Okay. Why, why are you doing that? So I can run there. We're not just going to teleport to Bent Branch Meadows? Out the... Oh, it's only 100 gil. Okay. I'm trying to learn, man. Yeah, no, we have money now, so we're good. Okay, okay. That being said, I, I'm I going to be right back. You entertain people, I'll catch up. You keep going, though. Go go to, like, there's a fate we have to do. You want me to go do it? Oh, wait, is there a fate? Is this a fate we have to do? Complete the fate. Don't be so... F oh, so we do it. okay, never mind. I'm coming. If the fate's up now, yeah, move. Move quickly. I saw it was, like, 13 minutes. Yeah. yeah someone else might do it. I'm stuck in a hole. Bad. I'm out. Yeah, I love this music in the forest. Very good. Egg, what are you playing? Res Resident oh, Evil 4. Resident Evil 4, that's what I thought, yeah. Mm -hmm. Original. Oh, not remake. Remember to sink your level. Wait, is this it? No, it's the next That's one. Not, oh. Thank you. Yep. I didn't oh, even notice the quest said to do a fate. There's a lot of people doing it. Oh, I got to look sick. Yeah. The 50 seconds. Pick up the eggs and bring them back. Bring at least one back. So we can be part of the quest. I don't even know if I'm doing it right. Did you hand over the egg to him? Talk to Hamlin? Oh, is he here? Yes. He's right over here. Go talk to Hamlin. Sorry. Uh, oh, you, it's too late. I mean, I grabbed some eggs. Yeah, it's too late. You had to turn them in. No. Uh, quest is fine then. Yeah, probably have to do that fate multiple times to get, uh, like, the reward, but... Wait, I completed the fate. Hmm. Wait. Hold on. I'm confused. So, did I... Did I not no. do it? No. Oh, never mind. You didn't do it. What do you mean? Because you didn't turn in any eggs. So you didn't I... actually participate. Oh, but I picked up eggs. Uh, yeah, no. If you want to complete the quest, you have to wait for the fate to spawn again. Well, you have to go get a drink, right? Uh, well, yeah. Go, go do it, man. I'll see. I'll, I'll wait here, and then if the fate doesn't start, then we'll just go to MSQ. Yeah, then I feel like you won't ever actually do this quest, so... I'll find time. It, I guess. No, I'll find time. How long is it around for? A bit? Um... I will find time to do it. Don't worry about that. So, if it spawns by the time you get back, we'll do it. If it doesn't, MSQ. Yeah, it is an event fate, so it shouldn't be too long before it respawns, but... Yeah. No, I, I promise this... It ends on the 10th. I will make, yeah, I will definitely have time. Do not worry about that. Okay, I'll be back in a minute. Yep. Very. I actually don't know this track. I did not recognize this. Oh, it's a version of Papaya. So I turned it. I turned it in egg. So mm -hmm. I, oh, and now you're. Yeah, you're good. You done at least one. 
Let's, I mean, we still have to finish it, right? Yeah. But I'm at least involved. Um. Oh, so the the other game I played today was um the murder of Sonic the Hedgehog. I wanted to talk about that. Why? So it's a visual novel. Yeah. So me and SP were just sitting there. Or no, you were SP. Me and OJ were just sitting there. Um. And I was reading Chaos Head while he was in VC chat, and he started laughing, and uh, I was like, "Is this real?" And uh, the answer was, "Yes, it's real." Um. And we, uh, how to put, uh, what am I going to say? Oh, yeah, it's, it's a, oh, boy, this is a chaos song. Huh? Uh, what was I going to say? Oh, yeah, I was saying, like, he was like, is this real? And it was, and I was like, I need to play it immediately. It's a visual novel murder mystery about Sonic and gang. Did you finish it? And yeah, it was like three hours long. There were like 15 original tracks. The art was incredible. The story was really fun. I got a lot of good actual laughs out of me. Uh, the mystery was interesting. It was free. And it was free. I have to like, I want that soundtrack. I want to listen to it. A lot of stuff happening right now. Yeah. At least it's not a long phase. Some of these are 20 minutes long. I was gonna wait, because we only got 15 seconds. Mm -hmm. I, I, I re turn in. The last of my quests. The last of my eggs. I turned in 19 eggs. Pa, 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 ya, uh. uh, I think it's at like 10 or something. Did I level up? Special oh, no, Midnight no, no. Archon egg. Nice. Wait, what did you get? You got, you got it too. Archon eggs. Oh! That, which I assume is the currency uh, you get from doing this fight. So, are we, are you teleporting? I teleported, but it didn't work for some reason. For you. Nope, there we go. New Gridania, right? Um, what was that? Yeah, you teleported to New Gridania, right? Yes. Yep, so I'm here. And then back to the end of the year. Which is gonna be... Oh, that's right, okay. Yeah, Okay. Sorry, I was quiet. I had to do behind the scenes business. It's okay. Let me know when you're ready. Yeah. yeah. I am ready. Okay. And here comes our new hero. Hamlin has just been regaling us with the tale of your valor, Meteor and Wife. We can't thank you enough for recovering those Archon eggs. Truly, from the bottom of our hearts and purses, thank you. My single regret is that no Rapturous bystanders were present in those solitary woods to witness such valorous place, this place. Alas, the Tomberry's Majesty will once again pass unacknowledged. Yet such is us. Blah, 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 blah. Yet such is often the way with true goodness. The hero that works in secrecy for the betterment of all. My friends, their name is Tomberry. <laughs> Profound, I'm sure. I must say, Hamlin, your unflagging devotion to all things Tomberry is both remarkable and admirable. Meh. Um, pardon me. Oh, uh, we, we were in the solitary woods and we saw what you did for us, or what, what the Tomberries did for us. I was heartbroken when Asil snatched away the Archon egg that my friend had given me. But thanks to you, it was recovered safely. You Tomberries have my eternal thanks. I only wish you didn't have to scare the Sylphs so badly. The poor things. 
Is there no other way to deter the mischief? I'm not even- you know what I'm clicking. My toneberry senses are tingling? Yeah, my tonberry. I see. Indeed! Consider this! If we decorate our eggs with a tonberry theme, the sylphs wouldn't dare snatch or sabotage them. A dark green coat on a large egg with two golden circles for eyes? Not bad at all. Perhaps even cute. Yeah! Woohoo! Jilly, perhaps this is what our dream, your dream foretold. Not just Tomberry guises, but Tomberry eggs and decorations as well. In which case, we should send word to our old Don goldsmiths that we'd like another batch of Archon eggs and some striking shades of Tomberry. Of course, all our eggs uh, are packaged during transit. It means the Sylph will likely continue their mischief outside the city. I'm tempted to send a Toneberry guard with the caravan, but the road from Ulda is far too long to attempt in such a guise. We shall continue to consi uh, consider possible alternatives, but in the meantime, should you happen to come across other way uh, waylaid shipments, uh, I hope I can count on your assistance, or as a Toneberry, of course. Well, seeing as our Archon have finally arrived, I dare say it is time to officially get cracking. Get it? Cracking? Like an egg? Let the hatching tide festivities begin! The game that made that one, it wasn't even me. I'm not happy with you. We have unlocked a minigame, Espy. Oh? My first minigame? With, uh, you'd have to go to an in-room and toy- Okay, Egg Advocate, talk to him. You want the Toneberry set? No? Where? Uh, in the audience. The Dreamer, Egg Advocate. Oh. So... Two, four... Oh, so I need to do some grinding to get what I want. Uh, how much do you have? I have ten. Okay, but so... One, two, three, four, five. Yeah, you have enough for the whole outfit. And if you want more, then uh, yeah, you'll have to do the fade again. Papaya D mastered orchestration rule. Hippity hoppity hatching tide advertisement. What is that? Uh, oh, that's for uh, housing, and like then... wall decoration. And then the uh, magic prism hatching tide, which uh, usually is like fire, uh, like a firework type thing. Okay. Uh, I'm gonna buy the whole body set. Me too. I'm gonna have to do this on my main. Yes, you are. Yeah, and to be clear, when I catch up, I'm gonna switch to my main. Like, I'm not, I will not uh, keep up with Wyvern, uh, with the Meteor once we hit get Endwalker. caught up. Well, no, what, not Endwalker, but like post Endwalker. I mean, like when we, you are doing the same content as I am for the first time. So oh, yeah. that'll be a year plus away. I'm gonna put a like couple hundred hours into this character, but. Okay. Um. What? <sighs> Your first holiday event. Wait, that's it? Yeah. Okay, now it's just grinding for the rest of it. Yeah, by grinding, I mean you can do it once and you're done. You have everything. Unless you want that a bunch of times over again. Um. Oh, wait, go, wait, go to your inventory. Click on the book, the baller medikit, and use it. Yeah. Now you have that emote. Where are you? There you are. We can. Um. Where is Frightened? There it is. Ah. Ah. Let us see you do it. I'm looking. It's the green one. Scroll down. Ah. All right. 
Now what? I, uh, well, now we're done Easter. So back to the main story, unless you want to do job quest. I don't know what the hell I want to do, man. Well, you have to pick. Um... Our job quests are level 25, um... And we're on the level 17 story quest, so we don't need to do them right now if you don't want to. <sighs> I'm mad at you because you're making me feel like I'm tired. <laughs> you're tired? I could have no, told you that an hour no, ago. I, to I knew it. I knew it. No, it just hit me. No, um, it didn't. Yes, it did. Don't lie. Uh, I could tell. Let's do... Let's do I know Espy better than he knows. Fuck you. Let's do MSQ. I'm, I want to do MSQ. Okay.